Okay, so what is up everybody on YouTube? This is once again your guy, Tubers Gaming HD, and we're back right here in Farm Simulator 2017 as always. I hope that you guys are having a lovely day, and I hope that you make sure to actually work hard every single day, also in the weekend, to achieve the goals that you want here in life. Whether it is actually kind of like you want to start a YouTube channel, just go ahead and do it. Do you want a big ass Tesla? Just go ahead and actually make the money for it, and uh, yeah, I don't want to give you guys the speech right now, but you gotta work hard at it. Don't let anyone tell that you can't do what you want to do. So uh, that is actually what I try to do right here. I'm back in Farm Simulator 2017, and I'm so stoked about this. We hit 11,300 kind of family members uh, today, actually. 11,300 subscribers right here on this channel. And I surely hope that we can get it to 11,500 subscribers before this week actually ends. So please go ahead, every one of you, please go ahead and actually subscribe to the channel right here. Just, just click that red button down below because there will be so much more content right here on the channel. The first kind of multiplayer session is going to be online on Monday, uh, this Monday actually. And uh, I'm going to give some further info on that later on, I think. Monday is just two days away, so it's going to be pretty stoked. So please go ahead and actually subscribe to the channel right here for more info. Also, give this video a big thumbs up, but we're going to take that later. Because right now, I'm going to take a look at some new mods that we actually got yesterday. But I was home at my parents. I was at work. I need to work because I need to get the work done. You guys know that. I need to work hard. I need to make some money so I can actually kind of like pay my expenses so yeah but right here we got some new march actually it is the red knock right here the red rock 180 slash 12.0 trailer it is a package actually the red rock 16 thon bulk trailer this version is an older design features grain and silage version with air brakes used to transport bulk crops silage and manure Holds 2,500 liters of material. The price is 21,500 euros. The maintenance is 12 euros a day, so it's really not that expensive. We're gonna go ahead and install it right here. And this is from CD Models, which is also a uh, modder, of course. Then we have this right here a, a new bale trailer or bale, yeah, it's just a bale trailer. A 10 meter bale trailer you can transport your bale load with. This is from ARM Arm Team. We're gonna install that also and gonna showcase it to you in this very video right here. So that would be kind of cool. We got it all done right there. Gonna go to career mode. Gonna go into the Cold Rally, which is actually the map that I used to actually show you guys the mods on. Then we're gonna press trying to deselect everything right there and trying once again to select everything. So start it out right there. And I gotta say that if you actually wanna be kind of like ready or if you want to get some info when there is new mods out there you need to be subscribed to the channel right here and also put on the post notification because that would be so cool i'm generally posting videos every single time there is new mods right here to actually show them to you guys and actually watch or kind of like view what these mods actually look like so if you like that please go ahead and give this video a big thumbs up also give this video a big thumbs up if you kind of like want to show your appreciation to all the modders out there putting so much time into the mods so that we can get them right here on the consoles so please go ahead and smash that thumbs up the last couple of videos actually hit 100 likes 200 likes so if this video could actually get around there it would be so cool so right now the game is being loaded it's a bit it's a little bit slow right now but we're ready to start out right here start out basically and I think let's see if we can get up to Morgan's massive motors uh, so we can showcase these new mods for you and we are up here right now as you can see so I think that we're actually gonna go ahead and we're gonna buy them so let's see if I can find the trailers at first that would be the first thing that we should do not that one it, it is this is this the one Ooh, a saddle black chassis I'm not quite sure. No, they're actually right here. So it is the Red Rock trailers right here. Gonna no, we're going to take the small one first, actually. And you have no option to actually kind of like, uh, modify these trailers right here. No option. There's only like three trailers. And you can't do anything about them. 
So just like that. Let's see. That was it. And then we of course have the one up in the bailing technology menu. So it should be right here somewhere. 10 meter bail loader. It's right there. No option on that also. We cannot kind of modify it. So here we have it. The mods, the new Red Rock mods or trailers or tippers. And uh, I gotta say, it's a little bit strange that they just kind of when it goes down to the ground right here you can see how it actually kind of just sits on the ground there should possibly be some hydraulic kind of pin right here that would actually hold up the trailer but there isn't and that's a little bit strange for me to actually understand but let's see if we can get up in the trailer okay so this trailer right here is uh, kind of being done to actually or kind of being used to transport crops I think this right here is a grass trailer, which is being used to actually transport grass and silage. This right here is also transporting silage and stuff like that. And you can see right here on the back, these are actually open right here. So they're not closed. That kind of like makes sense, I think. So um, yeah, I think that it would basically be a good idea to go ahead and show what it looks like when we're actually using this trailer right here. I, I'm not going to showcase the, the this one right here, the rolling kind. Of, this is just a bailing trailer. You guys know how to use that. But let's go ahead and actually pick up some stuff right here. So I think that we should go ahead and take the Krone Big X 1100 and let's put a pickup on it. Let's put a pickup on it. Ooh, I can find it. I can find it. Oh yeah, baby. Let's take this right here, the Easy Flow 300S. We're gonna take that on, actually. Uh, and let's see if you can put it on. Put some money on it. So uh, now we are gonna see if we can actually put this on the back of the Krone Big X 1100. Uh, doesn't really look that good. Maybe I should fold out the pipe. Oh Jesus, I'm just going to see if I can fold out the pipe right here, fold pickup, ah, turn on combine, no, pipe out, because I saw that the pipe was actually kind of sitting too close, what the heck, this looks, this definitely don't look good, but um, yeah, okay, we're gonna go ahead and try it because I just want to kind of show you guys how it looks like when you actually put something in this right here. So uh, I think that it is basically what we're gonna do right here. So we should be able to actually pick up the grass right here. Yeah, we are also ready to do that and uh, able to do that. So uh, it's gonna be filled up very fast right here. It's gonna be filled up very, very fast. We got it filled up almost right here. Yeah. So now it is literally filled up already. 25,000 liters of crops in the wagon right here already. That's a little bit strange to actually see or watch. But um, I think it's pretty cool though. And I really think that these trailers right here is also looking kind of dope. They really do. They really, really do. Really, really, really. Really, really, really really do so I don't know why it's actually lifted that much in the front uh, we should probably go ahead and just kind of throw this one the 939 review right here I'm gonna throw that in front of the wagon yeah and you can see that actually looks a little bit more realistic and more naturally so I think that we're gonna go down with the load down in my silage kind of like holder or what else you want to call it or silage place down here silage silo that is actually what I want to call it it's a silage silo so we're gonna put it down in the silo which is just down here and I can see the silo is um it's filled up right now so I'm just gonna place it out here I think okay open season so we're just going to place it right here actually. Whoa, 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 whoa. This is looking nonsense. Yeah, boy. 
Let's take it down again. Wait, how do you actually... Yeah, just like that. So now I'm taking it down. Down, down, down. My first love would be around just like, baby, 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 oh, like baby, 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 no, 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 what be with my, my, with you? I wanna talk with Emma, and I wanna be together. I'm going down, down, down. My first love would be around just like, baby, 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 no. I don't even know why I'm actually singing that song, but it's good though. Okay, so we're in here again at Morgan's Massive Photos at the parking lot. And um, yeah, I'm not going to show this one right here because it is basically the same wagon, just with a, some different kind of setup off the top right there. This one right here is just for normal crops like uh, wheat, barley, canola, corn, stuff like that. And uh, I think that they really look good in the red colorway right here. They really do. They really, really do. So yeah, I think that this video is actually going to end right here. And as I said in the beginning of the videos, please go ahead and subscribe to the channel right here if you haven't already done that. And uh, give this video a big thumbs up. And then we're going to see you guys in the next video at all, as always. So uh, yeah, thanks. Once again, for watching. There's going to be a video up in like three hours at 4 p.m. Danish time and at 8 p.m. Danish time. And uh, then we're going to see you guys again. Bye.